is somewhere in these ruins. There is considerable geth activity and an environmental hazard. Solar output has overwhelmed Hastrum's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. My shields are overheating. We need to stay out of the sunlight. This should come in handy. We need to find another path. This one will get us killed.
This is Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Can we provide assistance? Patch your radio into channel 617 Theta. We were on a stealth mission, high risk. We found what we were after. The Geth found us. They've got us pinned down. Can't get to our ship. Can't transmit data through the solar radiation. What's the status of your team? How many of you are left? We were a small squad, dozen Marines plus the science team. We're down to half strength now. Made the synthetic bastards pay for it, though. What brought you this deep into Geth-controlled space? You're asking the wrong person, Shepard. I just point and shoot. Something about the sun. It's going bad faster than it should. Some kind of energy problem. Any idea where the Geth came from? One of the patrol ships found us. Drop ships started raining Geth down on our heads before we could get off Systems under Geth control. We knew they made planetary sweeps periodically. We hoped going low emissions would hide us. Do we have to worry about the Geth sending in reinforcements? I don't think so. Their patrol ship hasn't lifted off again. The radiation blocks all off-world communication. How are you holding up? We can be there in a few minutes. Take it slow and careful. Direct sunlight fries your shields all to hell. We're bunkered down at base camp across the valley. I left Talizor at a secure shelter, then doubled back to all the choke points. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep them off you. You've got confirmation that the Geth haven't reached Tally yet? Affirmative. Left my best men with her. When you get here, you can talk to her on the comm. Every Marine on this rock is sworn to protect Tally Zora. As long as one of us is still drawing air, she'll be safe. You're gonna throw your life away for research? Negative. I'm gonna give my life for the migrant fleet. All the difference in the world. I'm no tech expert, Shepard. I'm a Marine. They tell me to shoot. I shoot. They said to protect Tally and the data. You get them out safe, I've done my job. Hold position. We'll hit their back ranks. Wait! Watch your ass! We got a dropship coming in!
altered solar measurements. The radiation keeps burning out our equipment. This sun shouldn't be like this. It was stable a few hundred years ago. Stars don't die that quickly. should do it. I recommend we move clear. These buildings are Quarian. This colony predates the Geth uprising. What could draw the Quarians this far into Geth space? Shepard. I'm sorry. Everyone here is dead. Any survivors must have fallen back. We knew this mission was high risk. Damn it. And what are you doing here, Shepard? We're in the middle of Geth space. I was in the neighborhood. I thought you might need a hand. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Carl Rieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. 
I got the data I needed, and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of Geth outside. What's this research you're after? It's about this world's sun. It's aging faster than it should. I can tell you more about it once we've got fewer Geth shooting at us. Would it help if I brought in the Normandy? Doubtful. These buildings are centuries old. If you bring down heavy fire, this whole place could collapse on us. Is anyone else still with you, or are you alone out there? Rieger had a team of Marines covering me when I ran for the observatory. At least some of them are still alive. I can hear them firing at the Geth outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth and the console is damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please do what you can to keep Rieger alive. Obscenus! Looks like the drone has an optical camouflage system. Contact. Over here! Get to cover! Squad leader Cal Rieger, Migrant Fleet Marines. We talked on the radio before that dropship arrived. I still got no idea why you're here. This ain't the time to be picky. Callie's inside over there! Jeff killed the rest of my squad, and they're trying to get to her. Best I've been able to do is draw their attention. Are you sure she's still alive? The observatory is reinforced. Even the Geth will need time to get through it. <laughs> and it's hard to hack a door when someone's firing rockets at you. The Geth are near platoon strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. 
huddles up and fixes itself. I can't get a clear shot while it's down like that. I tried to move in closer, and one of the bastards punched a shot clean through my suit. How bad is your suit damage? Combat seals clamp down to isolate contamination, and I'm swimming in antibiotics. Geth might get me, but I'm not gonna die from an infection in the middle of a battle that's just insulting. What can you tell me about the battlefield? Right side's got a catwalk with a sniper perch. You could wreak some havoc from there, but none of my men made it past the Geth. The middle's got cover, but the damn Colossus has a clear shot at you the whole time, and you've got Geth coming in from both sides. The left gives you some cover from the Colossus, but your ass is hanging out for the Geth. That's how I got shot. Any ideas on how to deal with the Colossus? Standard protocol with Arbiter class units is to sabotage the shields and whittle it down, you know? Kill it with bug bites. But the repair protocol blows that plan to hell. You try to wear it down, it just huddles up and fixes itself. So whatever we do, has to scrap that bastard fast. It probably means getting up close, past that cover. We need to get to Tally. Got any ideas? Just one! I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger, and I got a rocket launcher that the sun hasn't fried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy, maybe even drop its shields. With luck, you'll be able to finish it off. You've done enough, Rieger. You don't need to throw your life away. Wasn't asking your permission. My job is to keep Tally safe. This is our best. We don't have enough people on our side for you to take one for the team. Stand down! I'm not gonna stand there while you run into enemy fire. They killed my whole squad. And if you want to honor your squad, watch my back. I need you here in case they bring reinforcements. <clears throat> All right, Shepard. We'll do it your way. Hit him for me. Keep us alive. There. <clears throat> I'll hold him. <clears throat> Remove to our <clears throat> Easy. <clears throat> <clears throat> Go in peace.
more gas from getting inside. There, that should do it. Just let me finish this download. Thank you, Shepard. If not for you, I would never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. A lot of Quarians lost their lives here. Was it worth it? I don't know, Shepard. It wasn't my call. The Admiralty Board believed the information here was worth sacrificing all our lives for. I have to believe that they know what's best. I didn't ask what some Admiral thought. I asked what you thought. A lot of people died here. Some of them were my friends. All of them were good at their jobs. That damn data better be worth it. The price was too high. What can you tell me about your research here? Haystrom's sun is destabilizing. Back when this was a Quarian colony, it was a normal star. It shouldn't change that quickly. Any idea what's destabilizing the sun? If I had to guess, I'd say that it was dark energy affecting the interior of the star. The effect is similar to when stars blow off mass to enter a red giant phase. But Haystrom's sun is far too young for this to be natural. Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. And if the Admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Maybe not the whole rest of your team, ma'am. Rieger, you made it. Your old captain's as good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. Well, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty Board and let him know what happened. She's all yours now, Shepard. Keep her safe. Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Talizor. We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. I don't know who you are, but Cerberus threatened the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. That's why you're here, Tally. I need people who aren't Cerberus. People I can trust. I wasn't part of what happened to the migrant fleet, but I understand your distrust. I hope we'll get past that as we work together. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you, not for them. If it helps, check out the Normandy while you're here. We've gotten a few upgrades. I'll get Tally Zora the necessary security clearance to access our systems. Please do. I can't be part of your team if I don't know how the ship works. I'll be in engineering if you need me. Don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie, the ship's new artificial intelligence. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. I'm good, Shepard. Ready for anything. We live, we'll get loud and spill some drinks on the Citadel. What do you think of the state of the crew? Yeah, unless all distractions are removed, loyalty to the mission will s Anything else, Commander? How are we doing, Jacob? What's your sense of the mission? Felt good to take that collector ship, but we need to find a way to t Anything else, Commander? We'll talk later. Commander. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, good timing in fact. Excellent. Made breakthrough. Can share results while next samples grow. 
Hate waiting for culture analysis. Never fast enough. Usually no result in advance. Just checking work. Have to be careful. Getting off track. Discovery. Based on Prothean collector connection, can examine technology, chart reaper species modification, fall of Protheans. Tell me what happened. Early stages similar to indoctrination can guess captured Protheans lost intelligence over several cloned generations. Cybernetic augmentation widespread afterward. As Protheans failed, Reapers added tech to compensate. Mental capacity almost gone, replaced by overworked sensory input transfers. Transmitting data to masters. Is there anything we can do to help them? No. No glands replaced by tech. No digestive system replaced by tech. No soul. Replaced by tech. Whatever they were. Gone forever. Understand now? No art, no culture. Closer to husks than slaves. Tools for reapers. Protheans dead. Collectors just final insult. Must be destroyed. I didn't think you needed any more motivation than you already had to stop the Collectors. Enjoyed challenge. Saw necessity of attack on Collectors after Plague on Omega. Their work, my people. Hard to care about two armies, one wins, one loses, always work to do after. Now, have more context. See what Collectors are. Wasn't looking for other work before, don't mean to imply that, just committed now. Won't let you down. You said the Collectors had no art. I had no idea you cared about that kind of thing. Personal interest negligible. Sang a little. Multi-species productions for cultural exploration. Gilbert and Sullivan always had me do the patter songs. But not about me. Cultural artistic expression reflects philosophical evolution, interest in growth, perspective, observation, interpretation. Suspect you won't see any art in collector base. Culturally dead. Tools for reapers. Worse than the Geth. I'm sorry. I know that was important, but you performed Gilbert and Sullivan? I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. I've studied species Turian, Asari, and Batarian. I'm quite good at genetics as a subset of biology because I am an expert which I know is a tautology. My xenoscience studies range from urban to agrarian. I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. What is it about the Collector's modification that bothers you so much? Disrupts socio-technological balance. All scientific advancement due to intelligence overcoming, compensating for limitations. Can't carry a load, so invent wheel. Can't catch food, so invent spear. Limitations. No limitations, no advancement. No advancement, culture stagnates. Works other way, too. Advancement before culture is ready. Disastrous. Saw it with Krogan. Uplifted by Salarians. Disastrous. Our fault. You blame the Solarians for what the Krogan did? Yes. Like giving nuclear weapons to cavemen. Krogan unprepared for spaceflight. Technological advance. Krogan could have evolved alone. Worked out aggression. Been ready to use new tech responsibly. Instead, Solarians came. Disrupted Krogan culture. Used Krogan as blunt instrument against Rachni. Short-sighted. Foolish. If you feel that way, why did you work on the genophage modification? Talked before. Best option. That or kill them all. If around during first contact would have argued against it, wasn't there then. Do what I can. Thanks for sharing what you've learned, Morton. Proud to be here, Shepard. Thank you for including me. I had a wonderful chat with your friend Tally. She's not what I expected from her psych report. I like her. Tally's a good friend. We've been through a lot together. My female intuition says she wants to be more than just good friends. What makes you say that? It's in her body language. How she turns to you when you enter the room. How she watches your every move. Chlorians are so fascinating to me. But they also make me a little sad. Why do they make you sad? Their environment suits are so beautiful. But with their immune systems, they're trapped inside. I wonder what they look like under those helmets. Or what their skin feels like under those suits. That'll be all. I'll be here if you need me. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal.
It's great to see Tali on board, Commander, just like old times. It is her, right? I mean, because with the mask, it's... Ah, never mind. I assume everything is going well up here? Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made That's it for point. now. See you, Commander. Shepard. Just checking in. How you doing? I'm branching out. Got a list of enemies now. They all give me joy when I picture cutting them, crushing them. There's this one imprint, a solarian with the... What are they? The things on his head pulled apart? Bet it caused a generation of revenge. What is that, a few weeks for them? So what did you want? You know, I kind of thought connecting with your past would bring stability. <laughs> See, now we're having fun. Me remembering good deaths, and you with your... your funny human thing you're doing. My job is to hurt things. Direction, control, that's your job, Battlemaster. You're why I'm a soldier, not dead or crazed like an animal. Thank you, Shepard. You gave me purpose. Now let's find something big to kill. Gabby, you'd say the Normandy is a she, not a he, right? Of course. The Normandy's the sweetest girl there is. And Edie's a she. Tally's definitely a she. What are you getting at, Kenneth? I'm just saying I'm feeling a wee bit threatened here. A lot of female energy, and I'm just one man. You're such a dick. See? Look where your mind went. I've got to watch out for myself. What can we do for you, Commander? Carry on. Will do, Commander. Shepard, what can I do for you? Can you do anything to give the Normandy an edge over a collector ship? Definitely. With the right supplies, I can fortify our shields. The collectors cut through the Normandy's barriers immediately last time. My upgrades might give us a better chance. Shepard, what can I do for you? Is the new Normandy giving you any trouble? Please, Shepard, I'm a quarian. Give me a chunk of scrap metal, a circuit board, and some element zero, and I'll have it making precision jumps. I was worried about working with Cerberus engineers, but they know what they're doing, and they've been very polite. How's the Normandy running? Say what you will about Cerberus. They know how to build ships. The Normandy's running even better than before. I don't know if it can stand up to a collector attack, though. I'm researching some ideas that might help. Have you got time to talk? We didn't really have time to chat while taking out Gath on Hastrum, did we? I can't believe so many people died. Thank you again for getting Rieger out alive. All for data about stars blowing up. I hope the Admiralty Board gets some use out of it. Tell me about the fleet's Admiralty Board. It's one of two major political powers among my people. The Admirals make decisions related to defense or needing immediate action. They also handle major criminal charges, like treason. The other political power is the Conclave, a group of representatives from each ship. They make most of our laws and fleet decisions. Any news yet on the data you sent? I'm not likely to hear anything for a while. Or on an unsecured channel, for that matter. Have you heard any word about Cal Rieger? Did he survive his injuries? He sent me a message. It looks like he'll make a full recovery. Any time you get a suit puncture, it's a matter of luck. 
Rieger got out with a relatively minor infection. Having any trouble settling back in on the Normandy? I like the quiet. I miss the old faces, though. Presley, Engineer Adams, all of them. It doesn't seem right having Cerberus in charge of this ship. Are you sure working for them is the right thing to do? Does it look like they're pulling the strings, Tally? I'm not working for them. They're working for me. So you ordered the listening devices and tracking beacons that are all over this ship. I know you need resources to fight the Collectors, but be careful, Shepard. I fully expect them to betray us at some point, and we'll be ready. I'm glad to hear that, Shepard. Just let me know how I can help. For now, I should get back to work. Thanks for coming by. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? Can you do anything to give the Normandy an edge over a collector ship? My shield fortification will help, but I don't think there is much more I can do. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Hey. Talk to me, Jack. I got nothing to say. You act interested, but you got other things going. So don't pretend you coming down here is special. You make a lot of stops. Is this about Miranda? I don't care where you play, but don't act like I'm precious if this is just killing time for you. I'm not ready to break it off. Then why the hell are you talking to me? Get the fuck out of here! Commander, what can I do for you? You have a minute, Miranda? Always. I'm dealing with a few loose ends for Cerberus. We haven't had much free time lately. But I haven't forgotten our earlier discussion. I think we're crazy, but I haven't forgotten. Assuming you're still interested. Oh, I'm definitely interested. Glad to hear it. I'll be by the next time things are quiet. Commander, what can I do for you? Anything I should know regarding the Normandy? The crew's working well, and the ship appears to be performing to specifications. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Of course, Shepard. Join me. Still talking to Cole yet? Yes. It's still difficult. But he seems less angry. Will you hear my confession, Shepard? I wouldn't talk to you if I didn't want to hear what you have to say. When I married Erika, the Hanar let me leave their service to raise a family. But I had no other skills, so I freelanced. When Erika was killed, I pursued those responsible. Once I'd eliminated them, I had no goal. I accepted the Dantius Commission because I didn't know what else to do. Not the healthiest attitude to take on a mission. You're right, it's not. Looking back now, it's clear I'd resigned myself to death. I would have fulfilled my contract. If Nasana's guards caught me afterwards, it would have been a good death. But someone else was pushing to reach the target, forcing me to move faster, challenging me. I had to reach her first. I had no idea you'd plan to die in there. It wasn't a plan. My body had accepted its death. My mind had been dead a long time. Your mission gave me purpose, a cause to die for. A chance to atone. 
I was able to speak to my son again. I can leave my body in peace. You've had a hard life. You deserve some peace. Whatever may happen, my gun is yours. Do you need something? You mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. There's something else I'd like to talk about. Ask. Have a few minutes to talk? Later. I'd like to consider what we've already discussed. I should go. I shall return to my meditations. Shepard. I thought we could chat a bit. I would like that. You have been a good friend to me. That means a lot to me. If we both still live when this is done, you may call upon me for aid at any time. I will come for you, Shepard. Shepard. How are you? Perhaps we could speak later. I wish to meditate. I should go. Of course. Hey! Got a minute? I'm glad to hear Thane and his son are back in touch. It'll be hard, but I think they'll be fine. Good thing you broke up that catfight between Jack and Miranda. I was afraid they'd tear a hole in the hole. This one security guy keeps staring at me. I think his name is Bert. I'm used to being watched by security, but they're usually staring at my eyes or watching my hands. I might have to start cloaking through the CIC from now on. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. I just got a message from my wife. I've been listening to my daughter's giggle over and over. <laughs> That's so cute. When this mission is over, I'm gonna give her the longest hug she's ever had. <laughs> 